Hi friends, now I will explain some important configuration settings in php.ini. What is php.ini? php.ini is a configuration file in PHP which is read by web server only once when the web server is started. The php.ini file is located in WAMP server is. Just go to WAMP server, click on php, just open php.ini. Here I am explaining five important things. They are upload max file size, max education time, short open tag, display errors, PHP curl. What is upload max file size? In PHP my admin, I want to upload my school file. But here it shows only 2 MB. But my file size is more than 8 MB. Then what, what should I do? How we have to increase the file size, max file size. That's why we are using this upload max file size. Just select this and search. Here it indicates 2 MB. M is megabytes. So by default it is 2 MB. So I am changing to 80 MB. Just save the file. Restart WAMP, restart all services here. When we are reloading the PHP admin again, the maximum value is changed to 80 MB. Just check it once here. The file maximum size is 8192 kilobytes. In this way, we are increasing maximum file size for PHP admin. The second thing is max execution time. Suppose our PHP script is, needs to execute more than 30 seconds, then we can increase this value. By default, max execution time is set to 30 seconds. Here it indicates 30, nothing but as 30 seconds. So I want to increase to 300 seconds. Save and restart. WAMP again. So the PHP script is executes more than 30 seconds. If the script contain more huge lines of code. The next one is short open tag. Short open tag means in PHP you are writing like this. PHP less than question mark PHP echo high or less than question mark PHP dollar c equal to 10 echo dollar c and ending tag of php question mark get there but i am writing like this suppose it is less than question mark equal to dollar c semicolon question mark get there this is nothing but short open tag by default php disables this functionality you want to enable this functionality just go to php.ini search for short open tag by default it is off so just change it to on it is nothing but enable mode save php.ini similarly restart vamp again now PHP supports a short open tag now. Next thing is display errors. In development mode, we are open, we are seeing the watching the errors in PHP script. But in production mode, we want to disable these errors. That's why we are using this display errors disable. So just copy display errors and search here. By default it is on. So when we are trying to move to production, just change it to off. Now the user can't be able to see these errors. Save the php.ini and restart WAMP again. Last one is php curl. What is php curl? By Hitting or triggering HTTP request without loading in browser URL. 
we are getting the information through one URL. That's why we are using PHP curl. So you want, by default PHP curl is disabled in php.ini. Here the semicolon indicates that it is disable mode. So when you want to enable, just remove this semicolon and save php.ini. Restart vamp again. Don't forget when we are change any setting in php.ini, we have to restart vamp compulsory. We have to restart the vamp server again. Then only the changes are applied in web server. And also we are enable this PHP curly in PHP sections also. PHP extensions. Just go open PHP curl. Just when we click on this, it is enabled. Or go to php.ini, remove semicolon here. Thank you.